I'm back with another Call of Duty mobile video and today I wanted to kind of address something uh, while I play live here. So what you guys just saw was a couple highlights using the Arctic 50 in about two games. And I wanted to talk to you guys because I've been looking at my comments and there's this one video that I posted a while back. I think maybe a month or two ago, which is basically me getting 115 kills in a game. With the Arctic 50 with no VTOL. I was not using the VTOL. Because the VTOL gets you an obscene amount of kills. Uh, especially on Nuketown. So, anyways, I've been getting a lot of comments on that video. And a lot of it, it's towards like, that I, oh god, what is it? Is that I use aimbot, and that I was playing with a ton of bots, and that what I did was like no skill whatsoever. So, I just want to address it, um, about what was going on in that video. So basically, that was... That, oh, that video and that gameplay was done before the global launch. So, if you guys don't know, before the global launch was the soft launch, and that had quite a bit of bots in games. Now, they weren't all bots, but it was quite a bit. And so, with that said, the games that people would get into were most of the time like maybe three or four bots per team. Now, since global has launched... Oh god, I just completely screwed that up. Since Global has launched, there has been, I want to say, like, at least one or two bots per team. So they've definitely lowered it, and I think they're going to be lowering it some more. Uh, unless you play ranked. Ranked has no bots. But the reason that I have not been playing ranked is just because ranked is more of like a team thing. Like, you have to go in with like a full party or else you're going to get screwed. And I usually play solo. So when people say, like, how am I not legendary? It's because I don't play ranked 24-7. Like, ranked, literally, to get to the top 10 of Leaderboard, you have to play that constantly. Like, that's literally all it is. You have to play constantly with a full team. That's literally how you get top 10. There's no, like, secret. That's literally just it. So, like, yeah, there's skill involved, of course. But I'm just letting you know. Like, you gotta go with a full team, you know, ready to completely destroy them. That could have been a quad. But uh, the game didn't want to give it to me. But anyways, I just wanted to address, just letting you guys know, you can get a lot of kills with the RC50, and these lobbies the do not have that many bots. Unless you play like the practice with AI mode, the, the whole team is bots. But anyways, I'm going to focus up here for a sec. So I've not used the RC50 in quite a while. I've actually been using more of the DL, trying to get used to the gun again. Okay. Let me actually reload this really quick. Oh god. The centering is so bad, dude. Is that- oh, Okay, I, I can As soon as I missed it, man. Alright, alright, let me, let me focus up here. Let me focus up here, dude. Headshot! You guys are killing him so fast, chill! Damn, dude, my centering is not as good as it used to be. My god, dude, I hate this glitch. It's like a barrier. Target 
down! Reloading! Cover me! Sniper eliminated! Changing mag! We lost A. Sniper down! All right, there you guys have it. So, basically, just wanted to tell you guys about that video. I'll link that video down in the description because you're curious of what the comments are saying. Um, funny though, it really is funny. But uh, but yeah, I'll, I'll of course I'll have ranked play guys gameplay for you guys soon. Um, I've had it in the past. It's just going in solo is not fun at all. It really is not. Uh, but next update, or at least the devs have said that ranked play is going to be um, fixed in which like if you go in solo, you will only be matched with like solo players, nice So, which is good, so I can't wait for that. See, I just went 15-5 with the Arctic 50, and yeah, there you guys have it. Anyways, thank you guys so much for watching, and I'll catch you guys in the next one.